All right, folks. Today, I'm very, very sorry, but I, I am distressed. I am very, very sad. I am triggered, you could say. I found out that I am under attack. Okay, under attack. Brutal assaults on my character, right? On the articulateness of my entire self. People are just like, excuse me, you a slimy son of a bitch. And I'm like, me? Dear sweet innocent me? I'm so lovely. I'm, I'm like a flower growing from the crack of a sidewalk, like a weed ruthlessly coming from your floorboards to give you some ticks and fleas. That's what I'm like. But in an enduring sort of lovely way. Anyway, well, I was cruising the interweb trying to find pictures of kittens and cats when I stumbled upon something that made my heart ache. And I'm going to show it to you. And it's going to make your heart ache. Vicariously, your heart is going to ache through me because I have so much heartache to give. That's how much I'm hurt by this. I have become one of the leftists that they make fun of on the Daily Wire. And I'm kind of like, uh, me? I'm a leftist? Me? Do you sweet innocent me? Leftist? Lefty? Lefty wingle? I mean, I don't know what it is that makes you assume something like that. Perhaps it's the way I strangely lean to the left every now and then. Not of my own volition, it just kind of happens. I don't really know what it is. Uh, it's just it's just the way I present myself, I guess. It's old liberal Munoz, that's what they call me back in the back in the schoolyard. It was just like you, you're just too damn liberal, boy. Too left too left wing. I don't like that. But yeah, that's that's basically what they said. I'm not making any of this shit up. That's exactly what happened. Uh, why would I make that up? Why why? Why? Why would I lie? Anyway, let me show you the video. This is uh this is me. I went to a Matt Wall show at the University of Texas here in Austin. Austin sucks, by the way. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I'm going to stop it right there. This chick's, this chick's face. Your entire attitude. I don't know if I like that. I'm not vibing with that. What's with that face there? Damn, okay. Dude. Hey, wait. Shut because... the fuck up for a second. Thank you. There we go. First of all, here I am at a political speech, spawn an ACDC short in a Bloodborne mask. Was I the sexiest mother there or what? Yes, I was. And look at that afro. Oh my god. It's like that natural palm look that you wish you had. That's a whole lot of soul going on right there, basically. Well, I asked him a question about cancel culture. That's what I asked him about. But that's, you could tell from the title of the video, he's dismantling cancel culture or something. By the way, I didn't think his, his, his response was exactly satisfactory or anything. I was kind of up there playing the devil's advocate because, like, everybody else in line kind of, like, just said something about Matt Walsh personally. And I was kind of like, yo, so I have a, a political question for you. <laughs> I'm very articulate, by the way. We're going to get back to my articulate list here right now. Actually, you know what? I'm not, I'm not going to play it. You don't need to see shit, okay? Just know that I asked a question. He answered the question. It was all great. Oh, actually, you know what? I will show you one section of this. Let me, let me get to it. His response. Not the whole response. You don't need to know all that, but I want you to know this for a second. Let me show you. Cancel culture is class solidarity. Yeah. So sort of the people that were picked on are rising up against their tormentors type of thing? Is that? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I think that's total bullshit, personally. Um, there you go. I got this to Matt Walsh to say bullshit. He said a bad word. I did that. Thank you very much. So anyway, yeah, no. The reason I bring this to your attention is, like, I was... This speech, right, is from, like, what, two two months ago? And all of a sudden, boom, there's my face on Matt Walsh's channel. And I'm kind of like, oh, look, there's me. <laughs> that speech was two months ago. It took you guys this long to put this clip up. And it wasn't even, like, a particularly, like, confrontational way that I asked a question or anything like that. Like, I guess maybe they thought his response was pretty good and they put it in there. It's not really centered around me. It doesn't say, like, you know, Matt Walsh dismantles uh, woke leftist or something like that. But, like, you know, I'm kind of, like, on the section of the screen where they resolve for, like, the little, whoop, there's the leftist head, right? And I, I'm like, okay, I guess I'm a leftist now. I'm, that's what I am.
That's why I'm wearing this pussy hat. Because I'm a leftist. I gotta, I gotta contend with that now. Anyway, so we're gonna actually... <laughs> We're gonna see some of the comments here. Excuse me, that kid was so brave to ask a question in that setting when he has obvious speech articulation errors. Ah! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Me? Articulation? Errors? No! Absolutely not! I am so articulate. No errors whatsoever. I have never made an error in my life. Especially regarding my articulation. You're out of your mind, whatever the fuck your name is. Varick Assault. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, I am intelligible. Oh, yeah, yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. I, I like to Fuck you! God! What are your thoughts on Wabbit season? What the fuck is that? Are you making fun of my, my voice again? You damn bastard? I hate you. Fuck you. Why are they wearing masks? You know what? Why were we wearing masks? I... I don't know. I, I don't know why the fuck we're wearing masks. Sorry. It was a dope mask, though. Bloodborne mask. If you gotta be wearing a mask, wear the Bloodborne mask. That's what I'm talking about. ACDC back in black. You get that doing the 1980 tour? Well, thank you, Daniel Weevil, for asking such a lovely question. Uh, I did not get that doing the 1980 tour. I really wish I was on the 1980 tour. However, I was born exactly 20 years after the 1980 tour. Do I look like I'm come from the 80s in that? Do I, do I look old enough for that? I guess I have a mask on. You can't really tell. No, I'm not old enough for none of that shit. Class solidarity. I can't get too mad at you, because that's fucking funny, but fuck you! God! He's... My precious feelings. <gasps> hey, guys, my... My name's Daniel, and it's been you 24 hours since... Matt Walsh's audience flamed me. I didn't even... Do it! Fuck! Oh man, this is this is actually the double A meeting. Uh, you're looking for room 203, meeting for people that have been uh, wrongfully accused by white wing uh, media persons. I like the guy asking the question short. My second favorite band, but the most important band to me. Thank you. Who, who the fuck is your favorite band? Most important band to you? Get out of your mind. Why do his hands look so tiny? My hands are all tiny, actually. ACDC! Ah, oh, yes, class solidarity. Get rid of it. You know what? You know, okay, okay, okay. Matt Walsh, I need you to moderate some of this shit down here. I'm getting flamed in the comments, boy. I thought I thought we were friends. You know, I felt the connection. I was looking into your eyes. You said bullshit, and I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. This guy's voice, lol. What the fuck? Solidarity is talking annoying, banging talk. Okay, World, World Royal F250. That's actually a really cool name for ah uh, yeah i i like it uh you know what i like the name i can't get mad at you because your name is cool all right but um yeah fuck you was solidarity logan paul i wonder if that's actually logan paul that would be hilarious <laughs> fuck you first of all jesus christ is my dude wearing a black and black retro t-shirt to not be attacked i mean that would be a good defense mechanism, but no, that that was like the only clean shot I had that day. And that, and I love Back in Black, it's like the greatest album on Earth. Highway to Hell is a close second. Not a great answer. Actually, I have to, I, I have to agree with you on that. I didn't really think it was a great answer. Like, as far as Matt Walsh articulating like a, um, a comeback... I was kind of like, eh, that was a little weak, my man. That was a little weak. I mean, I'm not going to disagree. With, I, I agreed with everything he said, but it still wasn't the strongest answer back. I would have just made fun of his speech impediments. How dare you? Well, Logan Paul, first of all, fuck you. Okay. Second of all, I don't have speech impediments. That doesn't exist. Listen to me right now, I'm talking normal as fuck! I gotta stop with all the coursing, my mom's gonna end up seeing this and she's gonna get mad at me, so... <laughs> okay, well... I talk like a goddamn sex god, basically. Alright, well... I gotta say, I, I... I feel attacked right now. I mean, like... Me? Leftist? Leftist? Leftist over here? I guess I... I don't know. I don't know really what I expect the Daily Wild. I, I expect you to fix this Daily Wild. I want you to come out personally and apologize to me. I want I want gift baskets coming to my door, basically. I want 
a helicopter to come down and uh, I don't know if you guys can book like Jesus Christ can come down here and give me a pat on the back and be like, I'm so sorry, son. They unjustly attacked you. Uh, he was a lollipop or some shit. I want something like that to happen, man. That's what I want. That's what I want right now. That or you give me a check. I could be on the Daily Wire. I could totally be a Daily Wire host. It wouldn't be that difficult. Hello folks and welcome back to the Daily Wire. I'm here with another video about my top 10 reasons why I think aliens exist and AOC is probably a reptilian person. I don't know, it's it's interesting, the whole thing. I, I, I think it's pretty fucking funny. I don't know. Uh, I guess I, I'm glad at least that I got uploaded before the SJW Christian thing. At least. I need a fucking haircut, by the way, in that, in that, I hadn't got my haircut in, like, so long. Ah, uh, oh well, what do you want me to say? Well, Matt Walsh, all I can say is, because your team put this up, you are very much cancelled. And that's all that we have for today, folks. And remember, that's just a theory. A GAY theory!